of Salem Springs approving a $600,000 project for its sanitation department. It'll change trash collection from twice a week to once a week and fully automated. As KNWA's Tevin Wooten explains, it's just one more element to Salem Springs' recent growth. You see the men on the back of the trucks. It's been just like that right there for as far as we can remember in the department. Don Tennyson is talking trash. Temperatures and the heat, uh, we don't stop. We have to pick up the trash no matter how hot it is. But soon the sanitation department will get new trucks, making garbage collection automated and a lot safer. As sanitation superintendent for a decade, Tennyson has seen other changes around town as well. The department, when we, when we first started, uh, it was way before the new hospital got built when I was with them. Uh, the new high school, all that community out there is new. Now the view from behind this truck has changed over the years, but in Salem Springs, the city is investing big bucks in more than just the city's trash service. Salem just opened a new police department and is shelling out $4.7 million to expand its library. It's also home to a kayaking park that just opened last year. But back on the streets... Tennyson says he hopes the new fleet is just the latest to boost Salem standing in northwest Arkansas. It's a small community. Uh, communication is everything, and we have a great uh, game plan moving forward. In Salem Springs, I'm Tevin Wooten for KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News. Another project expanding the city, a $700,000 soccer complex that's set to open sometime in the fall. It